All right, next I'll demonstrate how to create a gallery view. Now you can see here I've brought up the create view menu and I've given this view a name. Now I'll select the gallery option and I'll go ahead and click create. Now you can see here that the gallery view was created. Now with the gallery view, you do have some limited options as to how you can customize the actual item cards. Now to do this, you wanna click into the switch view options menu, and then you want to click on format current view. And next you wanna click on the card designer edit card button. And this will display a content pane where you can select the fields that you would like displayed on the card items. Now to add fields, you simply want to check them here. And you can see as I do this, it will continue to add them to the card. And if you wanna remove them, you can just uncheck them. And again, you can see here that they're disappearing. Now you can also rearrange the order of the fields by clicking on the ellipsis and then clicking move up or move down. And you can see here that that's going to shift the order of the fields. You can also just click and hold and drag the field into the desired position. And again, you can see here that the card updated. Now, once you're ready to commit these changes, you wanna go ahead and click save. And you can see here that your changes have been saved. Now, one other note, if you click on the advanced mode button, this will bring you into the format view pane. Now, when it comes to gallery views, you can actually customize the appearance of these cards to add icons, color coding, you can change the formatting of the text, and so much more using JSON code. Now, if you want to learn more about SharePoint list JSON formatting, you can download my list of the top free resources, including JSON sample code that you can just copy and paste in your list. I've included a link where you can download your copy of that list in the description of this video below. Be sure to check out my two part series on SharePoint list views. I've included links to those videos in the description below.